that trying to escape from our country was like one of the biggest crimes you could commit in East Germany. You would go to prison for so many years if you tried to escape. And in East Germany we had the sports school system and you would have to run through different tests to, to qualify. I started here in Berlin when I was 14. I went to Berlin, lived in a dormitory and started my sports school here. So that was my first apartment. There's three windows there. And every morning I would like get the coal up, carry it up there from the basement down there to my apartment and fire up the oven with wood and coal. That was the, the view we, like we had it. Oh yes, I remember. Oh, that's painful. Ouch, ouch. Shut up, legs. This sport is about suffering. But it's also about making the others suffer. So I concentrate on that part. Okay, here we go. I had my days and my in the sun and I had my 50 minutes of fame and all that. But now it's time to be honest and realistic with yourself and go, look, I cannot win 10 races per year anymore like I did in my best years. It's just the way nature goes and that's how it should be. And it's actually amazing and awesome to see the young kids coming up. People have helped you before and it's only fair that I give something back to the next young kid coming into the sport. But you can maybe hopefully help him to steer this development into the right direction. For what's your tears? One for all and one for one. <laughs> Just because I can move my push bike a little bit quicker than other people doesn't make me a more valuable person. I'm not Albert Einstein, you know, or I'm not the president. I'm a bike rider. <laughs> okay. The fans, they, they like me. They make me into what I am now. You know, they, 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 I mean, they follow the shut up legs and, and all that, you know. Wow. The circle of life, taking and giving, you know. People, they, they, they give you support, so you should also give them something back. Plus, being married with children, that really puts you down on earth, you know. It's, it's like you just don't have time to like start flying in the go and like, hey, I'm the best, I'm the best, hey, I'm Superman. No, you have the kids, you know, and they will quickly tell you, Dad, come here, you know. Clean that cage of the rabbits now. Well, it's nine persons, six kids, my wife and me, plus the mother-in-law. And then, yeah, the dog and the cat and four little rabbits. Wow. Well, let me tell you, it's never a dull moment. It's never a silent or boring moment in that house. And every uh, year you can make it, it's like, huh, yeah, it looks like I still have it. And that this team still thinks I have a certain value. I, I can bring a certain value to the team and I can help the team to perform better. We walk together, we, we, you know, we, we are together, we are one team. And that is really, really important. It's got to be, be a group that is almost like a family, you know, that really works together and enjoys to work together. Yeah, if you can be part of that, it just simply makes you proud. <laughs>